Ik ben op het Griekse eiland Santorini, bekend vanwege de mooie witte huizen, de witte kerkjes met de blauwe daken en natuurlijk de azuurblauwe zee. Ik heb dan een afspraak met Takis Sotiropoulos en hij gaat me wat mooie plekken van Santorini laten zien. Maar eerst twee luxe vakantievilla's van Largo Villas. Takis, we are at Mansion Kiani. Tell me something more about this villa. This villa is a historic building. It's 200 years old. It used to be um, the house of a wine merchant, a wealthy one. We thought that it would be interesting to renovate such a property to offer a glimpse of the past. Mm -hmm. Actually, there are three apartments. Each one has its own bedroom, uh, living space and bathroom. Mm -hmm. This is the master bedroom. Actually, th that place was uh, the place where they produced wine. Ah, this is lekker. This is a bath the bathroom of the master bedroom. Nice swimming pool. Yes, this is uh, our top floor veranda. Uh, it's one of the best spots of the house because you can see the whole area, you can see the sea, you can see the vineyard, and of course you can see the whole village. Let's go and now and see the scenery from the caldera. Good idea. What kind of island is Santorini? Santorini is, of course, a volcanic island. Mm -hmm. uh, it is famous for its volcano. And right now, if you can see, we're on the top of the caldera of Santorini, where we can uh, see the volcano and, of course, all the nice whitewashed villages look into the volcano. If you stay in the villa, you can just uh, take a small foot, uh, footpath that leads to the caldera as well. And how long does it take to take the... Ah, it only takes 10 minutes by walking distance. So tell me, Takis, what's next? So next, we're going to a very nice traditional restaurant where you will meet Roland, which is the managing director of Largo Villas. Let's go. Let's go. Roland, wat voor type gasten trekken jullie? Onze gasten zijn typisch niet op zoek naar gestandardiseerde hotels met grote massabuffetten, maar zoeken leuke, originele, authentieke plekjes. Zoals dit leuke restaurant? Ja, de mensen van het restaurant hebben deze ochtend met hun eigen bootje de vis die we zelfs gaan eten speciaal voor jou uit de zee gevist. En het zijn die authentieke lokale toetjes waar wij voor gaan. Ja, verser kan niet, hè, Roland. Heerlijk, hè? So what's the next stack is? Uh, I propose we should go to the vineyards, mm -hmm. have a look and then test some local wine. What do you say? I follow you. Okay, here we are. Those are the vineyards. They have a basket-like uh, construction in order to protect the grapes from the wind. For Santorini, wine is a really important thing because the, each wine is one of the most well-known uh, wines in the world. So let's have a glass. Yes, of course. We are here in Mansion Sofia. This is uh, the second villa. This villa has uh, two bedrooms, uh, one master bedroom, one second one, one big living room. Also, it has a garden and it is very private. It's uh, one of the benefits of this house. Well, Takis, I think it's time to taste this wine. Yes, of course. I'm curious. This is a Sandorinian wine, one of the best. Mm. It indeed is a very good wine. Takis, Afgaris to Parapoli. Thank you very much for this Th wonderful day. Thank you for coming and uh, visiting us. And uh, we hope you had a good time. Thank you.